who gives away the ride today? It's home by the road. gathered here today at the Little Neon Chapel in Las Vegas, Nevada on April the 1st, 2018 at 6 p.m. Pacific Coast time to uh, enter into a marriage of two people. And marriage is something not to be entered into lightly or just in haste. Is something thoughtfully and with deep realization of the obligations and responsibilities that you both, Mark and Rachel, have as this journey begins with you. So I ask you both to treat each other with respect and love, and then maybe kindly think of the first time you met, and then when you fell in love, I don't know if it was instantaneous fa fairy book, or it took a bit for each of you, and then that day when you decided to get married, and now here we are, April the 1st, 2018. And so I'm going to ask a couple of important questions. First to Mark. Mark, do you take Rachel? I do. Oh, I've got a bit of a longer question. <laughs> I understand you take her. Uh, Rachel, to be your, keep looking at each other that way, Ben. Uh, to be your lawful wedded wife, to have and to hold from this day forward, to love, honor, and cherish, in sickness and in health, for richer or for poor, forsaking all others, for as long as you both shall live. If so, say, I do. I do. Um, and Rachel, do you take part to be your lawfully wedded husband, to have and to hold from this day forward, to love, honor, and cherish in sickness and in health, for richer or for poorer, forsaking all others for as long as you both shall live. If so, say I do. I do. Okay. And are we doing exchanging rings today? Yes. Great. Yes. May we have the rings? And rings have been used for many hundreds of years, especially in weddings and services to kind of bind people together. And the ring is symbolic because it's a circle that never ends. It's a never-ending circle. And you have that never-ending love for each other, and you'll always have that. And I'll ask you each and every day of your marriage, if uh, something goes um, particularly well, you win the Irish sweepstakes or the, <laughs> the lottery, or somebody names you the second Earl of whatever, and you would, you would, you inherit mass tracts of land. Um, or things don't go so well, or you have a bit of a at work or at home, just remember how much you love for, have for each other. Touch that ring, look at that ring. If that other person isn't in the same room, text, tweet, email, call them, and just tell them how fantastic they are. If you are so blessed that they're in the same room or on the same block, run up and give each other a hug and a kiss and just say you're amazing. So I'm going to take Mark, give the ring for Rachel, and then put that on her left foot. You're going to slide it and hold that. You're going to look at her and you're going to repeat after me. You're going to say, Rachel. Rachel. I give you this ring. I give you this ring. As a symbol of my love. As a symbol of my love. And that I'm choosing to share. And that I'm choosing to share. My life's journey with you. My life's journey with you. I give you this ring. I give you this ring. With the pledge to love you. With the pledge to love you. Today. Today, tomorrow, tomorrow, always, always, and forever, forever. And then like those fairy book stories on her hand, give her a princely kiss on the hand. Very good. Now, Rachel, do you have Mark's ring? Yes. Put that on his left finger, hold it, and then repeat, say, Mark. Mark. I give you this ring. I give you this ring. As a symbol of my love. As a symbol of my love. And that I am choosing to share. And I'm choosing to share. My life's journey with you. My life's journey with you. I give you this ring. I give you this ring. With the pledge to love you. With the pledge to love you. Today. Today. Tomorrow. Tomorrow. Always. Always. And forever. And forever. Great. And so we have 
exchange vows and rings. Are we ready to get officially married? Yes. Let's hold hands, get in here, and look into each other's eyes. So, Mark and Rachel, thank you so much for coming to this little neon chapel. Thank you for being part of this ceremony. Thank you so much for allowing us to preside over this, to be part of this enduring union um, that's taking place today. And so, by the power vested in me by the great state of Nevada, and also after having direct consultation with number 10 Downing Street, and also properly informing Her Royal Majesty Queen Elizabeth and the rest of the royal family in obtaining their proper blessing, I now pronounce you husband and wife, partners for life. This is your first day of forever as husband and wife. Mark, kiss your incredible wife for the very first time. <laughs> oh, give, a, give a, another, give that a rather passionate kiss. That's a rather timid kiss. <laughs> Turn around. And this is a Clap, everybody clap.